feel guilty, I feel so badly They say I made it and that should be satisfaction Yo, what is going on YouTube? It's your boy Danny, aka Nanny Phantom So we are here, welcome back to the channel Um this week we are going to be doing week 8 of UPBA. Uh, so first of all guys, sorry that like, this battle was like super super late. Um, because because of just my schedule and everything, uh, me and Jay had to play late. Like close, like literally the day before the battle was due. Then after that I was just so busy I didn't get to actually post the battle. So I'm so sorry that this came up late. I'm um, sorry Jay, I know you were looking forward to seeing my side also. So my bad about that. Um, but... Another thing is that I was gonna edit the video and post it, but then I saw that my little intro part, the music, like the background music was so loud, you couldn't even really hear my voice. Um, so I kind of had to redo that also. Again, I've been busy, so I didn't have time to actually re-record the intro. So I'm doing that right now just so, um, first of all, it's gonna be a little bit shorter for intro. I'm not gonna really go into the team. I'm just gonna put the, the pokey paste in the description. You guys can check out the team there. Um, the battle should be a little bit better. Um, the way I do it is I record my team builder before and then I end the recording. For some reason, the battle sounded a lot better. The music was still a little tad bit higher than I usually like it, but the, my voice, like you could hear a lot better. So luckily the battle, I don't have to record post because I don't like doing post. Um, but the, the, the audio should be okay for the battle. But for this week, guys, we are taking on one of the top people in the Pokemon um, draft community right now. And that is a JV. Um, he, he's a really cool dude, man. He's the homie. I've been talking to him a lot recently. Um, he's just an awesome dude. We both have just like a lot of similar like tastes like in music and things like that. Um, he, he's an awesome dude. He's been helping me out with the land stuff when I first didn't know about it. Um, any questions I had in general, he's just been super nice. He's never, he's never like, you know, he never sounded annoyed like me asking a question. Um, he's always there if I ever need help and I'm always there if he needs help, but um, he never asked for anything in return either. So like he, he's such an awesome dude, man. Um, so if you are listening to this, man, big shout out. You're, you're, you're the homie. Um, so hopefully this battle will be good. So hopefully everything inside in this battle will be a fun one. Um, but that should be that little like short intro. Again, if you want to check out the actual team, just uh, click on the poker paste and just look at the team that I, I brought then. Um, other than that, if you do want to check out all the other weeks, make sure you click on the top right. There'll probably be a little playlist there and you can just click that and then check out all the other weeks. And like every week, I always say, make sure you drop a nice like, guys, because it really does help out the channel. Um, and I will see you guys in the battle. Hope you do enjoy it. Sorry I didn't talk about the team. But again, if you have any questions, just leave comments and things like that. But I hope you do enjoy the battle, guys. So um, I'll see you there. Peace. All right, guys, we are back and let's see. So he does bring the Talipo, the Talipo, the Politoed. Interesting. So Dragonite, Politoed, Clefable, Crocodile, Machamp, and Serena. He doesn't bring... Wow, I'm going to take a picture and then put the Mons in in a second. Just so I can pick what I want. I think I'm going to just lead off with, with Urshifu, to be honest. That was kind of my game plan. Just to lead off with Urshifu. The only thing I was kind of not wanting to do was lead off in front of Azelf because if that thing was Scarf it could have killed us but it's not here which is huge because I really thought that thing was coming because I don't have the best like choice specs mess Brit switching which is awesome so let's just see let's see what he brings so Crocodile's here, Clefable's here, Dragonite's here, Serena's here, Azelf is not here, we got Machamp which I'm shocked that it's here but it's probably gonna do hella work so so it, there's that um, and then Serena. So let's put Serena. No way, I already had Serena. Uh, Politoed. Wow, I'm actually kind of shocked he brought Politoed, but maybe it's so he could handle it a little bit better with, uh, with Crocodile, handle my Chandelure a little bit better, which makes sense. Um, so we're gonna start with Urshifu, and let's see how this goes. So let me get my calc open so I can at least start doing some of that while things go on. Let me move my mic. I'm sorry if you guys hear me move my mic around. Alright, so he does start off with the crook, probably Intimidate, so let's see if it is Intimidate, we are Scarfed. Yeah, it is Intimidate, okay cool, so I think uh, I want to scout to see if Serena is um, Rocky Helmet. So what I'm going to do is U-turn, I mean if he's Scarfed we're still faster, so we at least know that, maybe he's going to put up rocks. I kind of feel, okay he does withdraw, here comes the Rocky Helmet Serena, I'm calling it. Oh no, it's Polytop, oh maybe this thing's Rocky Helmet, god damn it. I don't know though, bringing in... Yeah, this thing's 100% gonna be Rocky Helmet. Oh, it's not. Oh, perfect. Okay, cool. 
So he switches into Politoed. Um, what do we bring in on this Politoed though? Um, I wouldn't mind already going to Necrozma, starting to do some pretty hefty damage. Uh, we could go R2D2, our Porygon, uh, but I want to save that and I want to save a Moongus. So maybe I'm just going to go into Necrozma. Even though Necrozma is pretty great, I think I kind of want to use it to start breaking his team. So it looks like that U-turn did how much? Let me see how much the U-turn did. So he has leftovers, so we can at least see that. Okay, that didn't do too much. I am intimidated though. So leftovers. Um, I'm gonna click. I think I might just click Photon Geyser just to get some damage off on this thing. What else does he have that can come in? Nothing really. This thing will be pretty good from a champ though, so I don't know why they go straight into this, but um. Wait, is it not Drizzle? It's not Drizzle. Wow, interesting. Okay, should I just Calm Mine here? I might just Photon Geyser. Get some great damage off on this. And if he goes Crook, he goes Crook. I'll just go Amoongus. Alright, yeah, yeah. Let's just Photon Geyser. He does go Crook. He's probably gonna... Um, uh, what's it called? He's either gonna do Rocks or just hit Knock Off. Which will kind of suck. It will kind of suck. I kind of wish I did hit Flash Cannon because we could at least chip this thing. But now we just go into a Moongus, I believe. I forget like what I actually put to take on Crocodile. Like we built this team and I've been crazy busy, so I haven't been able to really. Um. Oh, he does put up rocks. Okay, cool. Um, not cool because rocks kind of suck for us. <laughs> Um, and I think here I'm gonna click Spore. I don't know, will he go into Serena? If he goes into Serena, I don't think that really does much, so I think I'm just gonna Spore. But he's probably gonna go into Serena. I don't know what that- uh, that sounds like a Serena. It is, okay. And now I'm just gonna Sludge Bomb. Um, this thing gets Triple Axel though. Which is not good. Um, but I think I might have to just do it and get some damage off on this. Um, trickle, Triple Axel's gonna do a decent chunk and if it's banded... Oh, okay, he U-turns. Damn, Jay's playing some nice moves right now. So we Sludge Bomb, is he gonna go into... What's this? Does he, did he have a Steel type? Let me switch it around here. I don't think he did. Okay, cool. So at least we get some, some damage off on this, which is not bad. Cool, so it's Guts. Um, I might just stay in, to be honest. Let me see what a Machamp might do to my Amoongus. Because now that Crook's not banded, I'm not too crazy worried about it. Uh, Calc really quick, I just want to see, like, Facade does a lot. Um, Sludge Bomb did a decent chunk. I might just Giga Drain, so I can at least get some health back. Um, Guts boosted, this thing's gonna hurt. Alright, so Black Sludge is off, but we're at least still able to get some decent damage on this thing, which is good. I don't know if I want to lose it though, that's that's just my, my worry. Because Facade should be able to kill us at this point. How much did Knockoff do? I should have I paid attention to that. Knockoff would have done like 41 to 49. Um, not sure what I really want to go in here to. I might just go Chandelier. Screw it. I'm going Chandelier. He's either go with Ice Punch, Facade. If he goes Knockoff again, that's a great play. He might do that though. Because Necrozma, Chandelier, Knockoff. Ooh, Facade. Perfect. Okay, cool. So, what I'm going to do here is sub up. And then try to Will-O-Wisp the... Yeah, that's perfect. Should I sub up though? Would he even come, like, use this thing again? Um, just so I don't lose health, I'm gonna just click Flamethrower. Yeah, I'm gonna just click Flamethrower. This thing shouldn't be faster. Oh my god, I didn't even pay attention to the speed. Oh, he does switch, damn it. Thickums, who is this? Clef? Okay, that's Clef. So, Thickums comes in, and this thing is annoying. Um, I feel like he's gonna- ooh, does it, is that a crit? Oh, that does so much, that's beautiful. Um, I'm not sure what 
I might just sub up here because maybe he'll heal up and I can at least hit him twice maybe, right? Or something? Or should I just go straight into a Moongus? Um, and then click Sludge Bomb or Spore? Um, I think I might do that, just go into a Moongus. Yeah, let's go into a Moongus, because then we can switch out again if we need to anyways. Um, he's either gonna Moonlight or... Knock Off or Shadow Ball, I think this thing gets maybe? Possibly. Shouldn't be clicking a fire move, I don't think. Okay, yeah, soft boy. I said moonlight, I meant to say soft boy. <laughs> alright, alright, looking pretty pretty okay right now. So he has the soft boy. I should write these things down. I'm hitting sludge bomb. Um so crook is not banded. Definitely not. Uh and it has stealth rocks. That's all we've seen so far. Oh, oh we have clear smog just for this situation. Because, Jay, you know, I watched, like, all your games. <laughs> um, so we hit him with the Sludge Bomb. Doing a hefty chunk. And now we clear Smog. I wonder if he's, uh, safety goggles. Ooh, this is probably gonna do a decent chunk. Because this thing is fat. Oh, ouch. That hurt. Okay, so that drops its, um, its stats, and I think I might go into Pop Smoke again, and then at least try to try to make it so that he can't do that again. I don't know. That might be the wrong play. I kind of need this for Crocodile, so that's why I want to do this. Because this thing is scary, man. Moonblast. Alright, at least he hit Moonblast so we can at least Flamethrower. Alright, cool. So I'm Flamethrowing again. Oh, does that drop special attack? Come on, man. No. That's trash, dude. Because now he can just kind of set up here. So what's my play? Let me see. I could go or Shifu. I feel like he's going to heal up here. So what I might do is... Flamethrower? What's stronger? Flamethrower, right? Yeah, let's flamethrower. Damn it, man. He has to drop my special attack. That that just makes it tough. Yeah. I wonder how much your Shifu would do. It's gonna be hard to beat this thing. Because if I didn't get the special attack drop, then I would have been fine. Because then I could have just kept flamethrowing. Um, and I feel like we actually beat... You know what I'm gonna do? I might go into Necrozma. Um, cause here he's probably gonna Calm Mind. And then maybe I can Calm Mind. Oh man, this is not gonna be good. Um... Let's go Necrozma. Damn it, man, that special attack drop just really was bad for us. Cause now we have to switch around. I wonder if he's weakness policy. No, he's not, he's not, because we saw the, um... Oh, okay, he's... Oh, interesting, I'm kind of shocked. Ooh, that does so much. Uh, I'm gonna Photon Geyser here. Actually, I'm just gonna Flash Cannon. Yeah, I'm just gonna Flash Cannon. Getting damage off on this thing is the most important. Uh, so right now it's about a 50s here. What is this, 75, right? Um... So it's about at 76. Okay, so we did hit flash cannon this time which is good so we can at least get some damage on crook which is always nice and our shifu is literally gonna have to hold it down for us because i don't know it's just oh he's leftovers on this too interesting so this thing is bulky as uh so leftovers and it might be over for us all right uh um, I don't even know what to do here. A Moongus, I guess, can drop, maybe? Or should Chandelure drop? I kind of want a Moongus, because then Crocodile just clicks Earthquake and kind of beats us. But we, I don't really think I can do much anyway, so... I think we go into a Moongus here. I mean, into... Uh, yeah, Moongus, yeah, yeah. And I kind of want to see how much... Uh, so he's gonna, what, knock off? Yeah. I kind of want to see how much, um, crit. I don't think that really mattered. Um, or Shifu. 
versus Politoed. So not Rain Setter. I don't want Rain Up. I mean, I do want Rain Up, but I know he's not going to have Rain. I mean, I already know he doesn't have Rain. <laughs> Close Combat would do so much. Surging Strikes wouldn't do much. Um, so I might just click Close Combat. Oh, I don't want to click Close Combat, though. Reason why is because then that, um... Then Clefable just comes in. Should I U-turn? I wonder how much U-turn does to Crook. Uh, Stealth Rock Crook. U-turn. No Intimidate on. U-turn does not kill. So I might have to Surging Strikes. Ooh. Just, thank God I clicked Surging Strikes. I clicked that by accident. <laughs> Alright, so he does go into the Polytoad. We saw that it wasn't Helmet. This is where I really just dislike my team. Oh, he's Water Absorb. I'm an idiot. I didn't even know that was one of the moves he could have. Uh... Wow, interesting. That's, that's pretty nice. I like that. Um, let's see. What what can we go into here? I think we just go into Necrozma and heal up. Alright, so Necro comes in here. Hopefully we can heal up. He toxics us, but we are Lumberry. This is going to be tough, man. Jay's team is so good um i don't even think moonlight maybe actually just cuz just cuz that crook but if crook comes in what do i go into cuz i need porygon actually maybe not as much serena's still there dragon knight my champ's gonna die um i might just moonlight Yeah, I'm just gonna Moonlight. I don't know what much else to do, to be honest. He needs to keep this thing healthy. I totally didn't even know that Polito got Water Absorbed. <laughs> so we already used up the Berry, which is good, I guess. <laughs> but he's probably just gonna click Earthquake. I don't see... I don't really see a way out of this. The reason why is because rocks. And like this is why I really am not the biggest fan of my team, because... I would have to bring Flygon and Klefki a lot to Defog. And I feel like they just don't really fit the team all, all too well, so... Should I go Melodic here? Oh yeah, I could use this to be, um... So maybe I can keep Necrozma and... Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Keep Necrozma and drop Chandelure because this thing's just gonna get hit by rocks constantly. So let's drop Chandelure. We've lost two mods, he's lost none. Which is always what you want, you know? So Earthquake comes and destroys us. Yeah, Necrozma's still good because it can at least 1v1 the Clef. Sort of. He gets leftovers. Oh my god, I thought it dc for a second. Please don't. Um, should I? Yeah, I have Melodic, so I might be able to just haze with Melodic. Or even Porygon. I don't know if it's unaware though, that's the thing. Uh, I'm going Urshifu because there's not much I can do. I feel like this time he'll go Clef. Or we can U-turn out. And then... But then do what? Like, I'm clicking close combat. <laughs> I don't know what more to do because I'm just going to keep switching around and taking rocks. This one's definitely going to be a tough one. I don't know if we're going to be able to come out with a W on this one, but let's at least try to do some nice work. I know he's going to go into Clef. Oh no, he goes into this thing. Okay. This might not die though. I kind of hope it doesn't because I don't want Clef to come in. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Not even close. This thing is fully physical defensive. Um, does it die? No, right? It wouldn't die from another one. Um, I don't even know what to go into. If he toxic my my Lodic, that's I guess that would be bad, but not like the worst thing. But if he toxics this, then I wish I had something to hit Crook. That's just killing me right now. What I might do is CC again. If he goes Clef, that would be bad, but. Even though this is like my only win con. 
we get the roll? Does this thing die? I don't know. Sometimes the HP bar hides under the little indicator. Oh, it didn't die. God damn it. I really thought I had it. Ooh, that's gonna kill. Wow, that's strong. Well, that's that's a that's an L for us, guys. <laughs> I really thought I got the kill there for a second. I'm sure he lived on like one HP. All right, so we're gonna get destroyed here. Uh, cause Flash Cannon is not gonna do much. This thing isn't gonna do much. Yeah, I'm just gonna call mine. And we can't kill nothing, man. Especially with Rock Sub. Um, I think we should maybe call mine and then Flash Cannon the Crook. I think we will live at least one Earthquake. So at least to get some damage on Crook. Yeah. This crook was a nuisance. Let's see, let's see. I used up, yeah, I used up the Lumberry, so he's definitely gonna click Earthquake. And I think it would kill us, I'm not sure. He's obviously not banded. Uh, Necrozma, Earthquake, Knockoff. Yeah, I mean, at least we can do some damage. I know this thing is really bulky kind of just giving up here because I mean like what can I really do at this point I don't know maybe I can do some more um maybe I just go melodic nah I really just don't see a way out of this um so we flash cannon here do at least a little bit oh we're faster yeah I had a feeling this thing looked pretty bulky to me oh interesting okay I thought he would just like kill us oh great course out of everything that had to come out <laughs> had to be Porygon oh, at least we intimidated kind of kind of heat you know yeah man this 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 is a really tough game he's obviously gonna knock off um, and if we go Milotic we need Porygon we can at least live one knockoff with Necrozma Cause at least my Lottie can come in and, and hit the Crocodile. So I have to go into Necrozma just cause I don't want to knock off and knock off my leftovers just yet. Oh, okay. Interesting. Does he not have knockoff? Oh, that's great. So this move was actually pretty nice. <laughs> well, not really cause we would have killed it anyways. Alright. And it gets hit by poison. Is it dead? Not right. Okay, cool. So here we just flash cannon. And then Crocodile comes in again. And we flash cannon again, right? At least we killed one, guys. At least we killed one. Alright, um, Crocodile's obviously gonna come out. Earthquake's gonna do a good chunk though, but I feel like Crocodile's just super bulky. Cause a plus one flash cannon. Oh, actually, maybe not. But we are. I don't. I'm not sure what we're at. But he shouldn't be able to kill us. So maybe we call mine Dan flash cannon. Depending on where I am. Cause we don't have the item anymore, so he can't. So knock off. Yeah. So earthquake and knock off do about the same. So I have to see if I am at 44, at least like 45 HP. I really hope that. It wasn't a speed tie, the flash cannon. And our walls are literally gonna have to hold us down. <laughs> so Bandit comes in, let me see where I am, health-wise. I don't think I'm at... Okay, I'm still above 50, let me see how much... What is it, 1, 2, 2... I'm at 60. I think I should live. Um, so I'm gonna calm mine, and then flash cannon. Oh, he might roar though, actually. I should have just flash cannon. Oh, he. Oh, it was a speed tie. Oh, god damn it. Alright, so I'm definitely not gonna win the second speed tie. <laughs> yeah, right? Because I went. Oh, no, I'm an idiot. He roared. Oh, god. Yeah, I suck. I think he had like mad time too, which is wild. I forgot he roared. I'm stupid. Yeah, he has so much time, wow. Yeah, this is an L, guys. I'm sorry I played terrible today. 
Um, but even if I played well, I don't really think I could have won just because um, Jay's team is so good. And again, he's <laughs> like one of the top players. Um, so having a good team and being good is not do well for me. That's crazy. How much did that do? That didn't even do... Actually, yeah, I think that did about what it said on the calc. I'm so stupid that he, <laughs> he went for Roar. <laughs> Should have had Dragon Dance, man. Even though he's a Timidate, at least I could have hit it with a Break Break, you know? So we die, and now we go Milotic, I think, and just do nothing. At least we killed one. I mean, we can definitely do some damage to this thing. And um, I'm gonna hit Scald. Yeah. I don't know, maybe I can still win, like, <laughs> stalling out, but even timer is, like, so low. He does have the Porygon, but the Porygon is very, very low too. Okay, so here we Scald. Be nice if we get a burn. He's definitely gonna knock off our leftovers. Um, our two walls are literally gonna have to hold it down for us. Uh, he's probably gonna go Clef or sack the, yeah, sack this thing. And then go Clef. Right. Oh my god, I'm an idiot. I keep forgetting about that, man. I keep forgetting this thing gets that. <laughs> man, I am terrible today. I apologize, guys. That just literally made it no hope at all now. Because this thing can just toxic us. Um, What is better to have this or Porygon? I think... I think I'd rather have Porygon toxic. Yeah. And then I can just keep spamming try attack. It's definitely gonna toxic. I'd rather have my Lodic though. I keep forgetting about Water Absorb. Oh, hit me with a Water Move. <laughs> Alright, so at least I can get some damage off on this. Um, Maybe Clef comes in though. But we can always haze the cleft, but the thing is that we can't really beat it just because uh, it has, it can heal itself, it can calm mine up and things like that. So let's hit it with a try attack. And now I don't know if, if cleft is um unaware or not. Not that it matters. Well, I would have at least been able to like see if maybe I can toxic or if that's just a waste of time. Alright, so this thing is going to be a, a menace, and we're going to hit try attack. There's not really much more we can do. Now, I don't know how Jay makes his move so quickly. He has like double the time I have, and I don't feel like I, <laughs> I've definitely not like done too terrible with time, but he has like double the time. So he's going to go clef. Yeah, clef. Uh, and then I think he soft boils up. I kind of hope we get like a para or something. We deserve a little bit of luck. I think we got crit, special attack drop. Um, so we got Milotic now because this thing isn't really going to do anything. Um, he might just click Moonblast, but like there's not much we can do because if he starts calm mining up, it's pretty much just over. Alright. Melodic, yeah, calm mine. Haze shouldn't lower our speed, right? So we should be able to haze that. You know, haze that clef. I'm pretty sure he's life work. Alright, so let's haze here. Haze it up. Damn, I'm so mad at click skull, man. <laughs> So mad at Click Skull. I would have killed that Politoed and Porygon wouldn't be toxic, and then we at least would have had a little bit more of a chance with the two walls to try to wall everything. <laughs> but either way, I think Timer, like he could have just literally stalled out, stalled, stalled us out if he wanted to. We just hit Ice Beam. Maybe we get a nice freeze, you know? Yeah, we can't really do much of anything. <laughs> 
And I'm scared to click Scald because that poor, I mean, that Polytoad is just gonna come in. So here we haze again. We're just gonna have to play this game until we lose, pretty much. Because who knows, maybe I get a freeze and he freezes the, the rest of the game, you know? So I'm gonna haze here. Haze, and he's still probably gonna do a decent chunk because I'm sure he's life orb. Yeah. This is definitely not, uh, yeah, this is a. Oh my god, I give up now. <laughs> I just completely give up now. I'm about to just let him kill me. <laughs> there's no point. I mean, either way, I, I, I don't think I could win, but now there's just really no point. Because I can't even do any damage. Uh, let me see. Let me see. Could go this. Yeah, screw it. Let's just go this. Damn man, like that that one special attack drop on Chandelier really messed me up big time. Let's see what is it, Magic Guardian, of course, because he's most likely life orb. Oh, okay. Kinda shocked he did that. I can at least recover here. Kinda wish I had teleport. Yeah, I'm gonna recover here, because he's probably gonna protect. So let's see what he does. Oh no, he's probably gonna go back into Clef. And we know it's Magic Guard. Wonder why he switched out. He thought I was gonna click Skull. Maybe he didn't see the special attack drop. Let me see. No, we can't Toxic, obviously. So we just go back into Melodic. He's probably gonna hit Moonblast. We can freeze, man. We can get a nice freeze. The special attack on Melodic didn't really matter. Like, I really think it's literally impossible for me to win. I could at least kill Polyto, man. I'm slacking. I'm about to not even... <sighs> I just feel like I can't even win, you know? So what's the point of hitting Haze? Because I can't hurt this. It has soft boils. I have no time yet. I'm just not even gonna... I'm not even gonna waste Jace time. I feel like there's no point. Oh, so he goes back into Polytoad? Okay. Jay, I was just gonna let you end it with Clefable there. Oh, he wants to toxic me. Okay, okay, that makes sense. I'm just gonna stay in. <laughs> like, there's no way I can win just so this video doesn't go on for so long if I wasn't if I wasn't an idiot and I didn't scald before I would have um, I would have tried like to at least get something out of it because I think Porygon 2 and my kind of could have at least held it down for a little bit because Polito would have been down nah not really I think I think it would have just been a 4-0 instead of a 5-0 <laughs> So I'm just gonna keep scalding up. I mean, not scald, uh, ice beam. And that should be GG. We take another L. I think we've lost twice. Yeah, we lost twice. So we should be four and two now, like our own record. But don't forget, we took over a team, so the record obviously on the table is a little bit different. Man, I can't wait to, to do UPBA next season and have my own team. <laughs> it's just like, I don't know, you don't, you're not as, uh, it's, it's not as fun to build. And that's my favorite part, building the actual team. Come on, Jay, just end it. I'm not even gonna, um, recover. I'm just gonna click Ice Bane. Oh, oh, I almost died in the max by accident. <laughs> I could have brought it back first. So this should be a 5-0. It's a big loss. I feel like uh, playoffs is going to be very hard to, um, to get to. Come on, give me a nice freeze, man. It's not going to help me, but it would at least give me something, you know? <laughs> 
Wow, I can't believe that Psychic actually killed her Shifu. How strong is Polyton? I'm actually interested. Let's see its special attack. It's probably pretty good. Yeah, it looks pretty good, 90. And what is her Shifu's the death? I don't think it has much to death. Her Shifu, yeah, oh yes, but that's terrible. Alright. Let's end this now. Just kill me, Jay. Come on. <laughs> You know there's nothing I can do. Interesting. He wants to get some kills with Serena. Oh, now I get to freeze, really? <laughs> Come on, man. Couldn't let Serena get some nice kills. I like Serena. She thick. Should've named Serena Thickums. We hate, I mean not hate, we Ice Beam. I'm just clicking Ice Beam until Porygon and Milotic die. <laughs> I don't like to run. I don't know, I'm just... Like, I don't know. I like to finish the game at least, even though I'm literally just clicking Ice Beam. wonder why he switched. I feel like he could've just stayed in with Palitoke. I feel like by now he should've known I was just gonna spam Ice Beam until I die. Alright, so Melodic goes down. I made so many misplays today that, like... That Polytone one was the biggest one, though. But I don't know. I feel like with his bulk, his clef, and... Uh, actually, no, maybe, maybe I could have done something. At least the Toxic doesn't beat us. That's kind of cool. I'm just gonna keep clicking Try Attack. I should have clicked Ice Beam, man. That would have been nice. Very nice. Alright, let's get another freeze. Wow, Porygon's strong, man. Uh, an Ice Beam. Why not? Jay, you should end it, please. <laughs> Alright. We're gonna have to make a big comeback next week. I don't even know if we can make playoffs at this point. I don't know, what is, I'm kinda confused as to what Jay's doing right now. Jay, I'm not even gonna recover, just kill me please. <laughs> kinda confused, I don't know, I don't know what. I'm not really sure. I'm really not sure what Jay is trying to do. Like, I really can't win. Unless he gets frozen here to the point where he never uh, thaws out. That's literally the only way I could win. Jay, end it. Please, man. I beg you. Here's the calm mind. attack for days. I think you just want to end it off with Clef. Because me and Jay be saying, you know, I be saying um, Tog is the best fairy and he be saying Clef. And I can't say Clef is it, you know. I love me some Clef. gonna keep try attacking Cause again there's no point I really like <laughs> I can't do anything and we try attacking again at least Porygon didn't die from toxic that's a plus right hit him with one of those and that should be game Alright guys, so that, like, you know, that was pretty bad on my side. I made a lot of mistakes, but I would have had to play, like, out my mind to beat Jay. Uh, his matchup was so good. My team was just, it was so hard to handle. I, I felt pretty good going into it, but I just knew it was going to be tough. 
Um, but guys, please, please check out Jay's channel, man. Like, as you guys saw, he just completely wiped me out. Um, he's really, really good. Um, I still, like, I watch all his games because I learned so much from him. And, um, and I like his playstyle. His playstyle is a lot like my playstyle. Um, you know, like bulky offense. Um, or balance too. Um, but more bulky offense because even if he has bulky mods, he always runs them offensively, which I like. Um, but make sure you guys do check out his side of the battle. Probably a lot better than mine because I was pretty booty today. Um, but please, please still leave a like, even if we, even though we got tossed around a little bit. Um, and uh, just show the support. I'll see you guys next next week, and just show all the love to J2. All right, guys. So peace.